Hello and welcome to our channel. Today we'll be showing you how to get up and running so you can start creating, editing and testing flows in UI flows in Power Automate. We need to go to their documentation page. They have some instructions to guide us in the process. The first thing that we need to do is to download the installer. Once that's completed, just open it and then accept the terms and conditions and click on install. Please note that the second checkbox is not a requirement. You can uncheck it and still continue with the installation. Once that's ready, as per the documentation, you should be, you should be seeing a pop-up in your Chrome browser. However, it may be that you don't get it, just like me. After finishing the installation, my browser didn't do anything, so we can't continue with the next step. To fix this, I just reopened the installer and then open the advanced options section and there you will see a link that will direct you to, to the Chrome extension store and there you can click install. Once you click install, you will see a pop-up and you just need to enable. After that, you should be seeing this icon in your browser. They also give us some tips right here so you can get it in case you're having some issues but the workaround of reopening the installer worked perfectly for me. Now let's continue with the next step. This is basically needed only to record web applications. We need to have the Selenium extension installed in our, in our browser. We need to click on this link and this is going to direct you to the corresponding extension. You just need to click install, it's going to quickly download something and after that you should see this icon as well. These two steps are enough to start building and testing your flows. However, if you want to run them using a trigger, for example when a new email arrives or if a SharePoint list is updated, you will need to install a data gateway. We're gonna leave the link to that in the description of the video as well. Now that we have our extension set up, let's go to the Power Automate page in Office 365. We click on Flows and then UI Flows and then we click New. The next window is going to ask us to put a name to the flow and then the link in which we are going to record our flow. I'm going to put Google. After that, you need to click on Launch Recorder. It's going to open a new Selenium window. Then we need to click on this Record button and it's gonna get us into a new browser to the link that we indicated. I'm just gonna write some strings here and then I'm going to stop the recording. After that, you can just click on this play button and you will see how the browser automatically opens and starts writing what we typed in the test. After that, you just click save and it's going to be added to your list of flows. And that's it for this video. We hope you find this useful. Thank you so much for watching. We are PowerGI.